Hey, what's up, fellas? How you doing? Man, it's Anelli here. Hey, what's going on, guys? How we doing? Man, it's Anelli here. Today, answering your questions. Today's question is, do catchers chat with hitters during the at-bat? Okay, so we're going to get into that in a minute. Before we do, today's video is powered by Triton. For all of you that have watched our videos and followed our teams for the last five years, you've seen us in a bunch of different Triton uniforms and gear. They do a great job. They've been supplying us for the last five years. If you guys want to check out their stuff, go to custombaseballjerseys.com. You'll see some of our stuff on there. They do an amazing job. Definitely go over and check them out. Okay, so catchers talking to hitters. How does that work? Do they say nothing? Do they talk at the beginning of the bat, during the at bat? And so we're going to kind of go into the history of me playing uh, throughout the levels and kind of what happens, okay? So let's, let's start off right at the major leagues. In my experience, the catchers are going to typically say hello to the hitter when they come up, right? Especially after a while, you get to know catchers, right? You're, baseball is one of those games where you see guys all the time, right? You're going to play the same team like 10, 20 times during the year. And so you get to meet everybody. Um, and so usually what happens, you walk to the plate and the catcher is going to be like, hey, what's up, buddy? How you doing? Good to see you, whatever. Um, and then usually it stops after that and then you're going to go through the at-bat, okay? Most catchers are not going to try to talk to the hitter during the at-bat. Most hitters aren't going to like that, okay? Quick story, if you go way back, back in Little League, I won't mention his name. If you're watching this, maybe he'll know who it is. There was this one catcher that would talk to you and like try to distract you they wouldn't shut up during the at bat and i remember every time we'd play him i'd be like oh my god like i gotta play against him today he's not gonna stop talking and so you get up there and he'd be like hey what's going on man nothing much man how, how you doing good to see you and then i get up and be like yeah so uh how about that you know game yesterday with whatever and i'm i'm trying to like I don't want to be rude and just say shut up but I'm like trying not to pay attention and then he would be saying jokes and eventually I had to be like hey like not not during the at bat man like can I can I hit please so in the major leagues and especially when you start to get older the talking usually ends once the at bat starts now something might happen right you might foul a ball off or something or catch a block ball you may talk to him really quick in between pitches but it's typically not, you're not going to have a conversation. Listen, it's hard enough at the major league level to hit, um, period. And so it gets really difficult when you're trying to have a conversation. Someone's trying to talk to you while the at-bat's going on. Right? There's a lot of stuff that you're thinking through. You're thinking about the game situation. You're thinking about how the pitcher attacked you before. Every pitch that comes in when you step out for a second, you're thinking about you know what's the count and what's the history with this guy and what's you know what does he typically do in this count in this situation, blah 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 blah. Right. So you're going through all of that stuff. So there's not really much time to be focusing on a conversation with somebody else. Okay. So. That's at least the way I've seen it. Now, I have seen a couple hitters. Uh, Tug Hewlett was one. Uh, there's a couple of them that seem to really want to talk to the catchers during the at-bat. So, like, I had I, a couple guys. Again, this is not the majority guys. A couple guys, you'd see them, like, take a pitch and then, like, start talking, whatever. Yeah, yeah I know, right? They take a pitch and go back and talk. Like, And I remember I used to watch Tug do it and be like, how the hell does he do that? Like, I could never, ever, ever do that. I, I have to focus on what's going on. I think some players, that might be a way to just relax them, right? It's like a, a comfort level. Guys that like to talk, to, that like to communicate with players, you know, he might feel awkward if he doesn't talk to him and he's just paying attention to the pitcher. So I guess it depends a little bit, but in my experience, I say 95% of the guys, maybe more, hitters just want to hit. Catcher's not going to bother them. They're just going to say hello once the at-bat starts. Um, I do remember playing, there was one catcher, Everyone that I went up to would say hello, or I'd say hi to them, or they'd say hi to me. I remember Chris Iannetta with the Rockies he was. I went up once and said, hey, what's up, buddy? How you doing? And he didn't say anything. And then I went up the next time. and was like, hey, what's up, man? How you doing? He didn't say anything. And I was like, okay, I guess I'm not going to talk to this guy anymore. He doesn't want to say anything back to me. So some catchers don't want to talk either, which is fine. Um, one thing that you will notice, though, is catchers will talk to umpires. So there's some umpires that like, and these guys kind of bother me too, 
you'll have some umpires that don't stop talking, right? They're always talking to the umpires. Not a lot of them, but some of them, right? So typically there's going to be a conversation going on with them, but usually it kind of stops, again, once the at-bat starts. But there's I've seen some umpires from up there, and after every pitch, the umpire starts talking to the catcher, the catcher's talking to the umpire, and I'm sitting in there, I'm digging in, I'm thinking about what's going to happen, and like he's still talking, and it can be distracting sometimes. So there's de definitely some umpires that I was like, oh, no, not this guy. Like, please don't talk to him. I at bat I never said anything like hey can you guys be quiet back there um but it's just the way it goes I try as hard as I can to kind of zone that out and usually when things are going like really well and you're in the zone you don't hear as much like the crowd all of a sudden goes quiet and you don't hear the conversation as much but when you're struggling a little bit at least this was for me when I was struggling a little bit like I could hear everybody I could hear the guy like up in the balcony being like you suck and this guy like it, you could just all of a sudden you don't focus as hard. I don't know why that is. You just start hearing all this different stuff. So um, anyways, that's kind of how it works between catcher and hitter and then how umpire can kind of get into that conversation as well. So if you've had any other experiences during your playing days or uh, during your at-bats, put in the description or the comment section below. Subscribe to the channel. Share the video with all your friends. Give it a thumbs up, all that good stuff. Check out the description box below. We've got a bunch of stuff down there for you guys to check out. And that's all I have. Thanks so much for watching. I appreciate it. And we'll talk to you later.